Hello, my name is Elizabeth Shaha. Today we're going to talk about chunking, and this is actually a form of assignment planning. So first off, you could create a, a simple table like this. You could do this on Google Docs, you could do this on Microsoft Word, and I just have a table that has uh, these headings. So course, assignment or task, next steps, deadline. So first off, you would uh, you know, share what course you have, what assignment you have, and then the deadline. And once you do this for all of your courses, you could uh, organize this chronologically based on the deadline so you know what the priority is. Then you would break down each of your assignment into smaller steps. So here first we have meet with a TA. This could be very helpful so that you could ask any questions before you even start in case you're confused, if you're worried about you know, making any mistakes, this could be very valuable. Then you could also meet with a new college librarian. So if you are unfamiliar with this, you could just Google U of T new college library. You could click the first link. And if you scroll below, you could book a consultation. They help with uh, citations, bibliographies, research, and they have several time slots as well. So you're more than welcome to book and get some additional help. Then you would carve out time to do your readings, and then you might even want to go to the writing center, right? So I have an appointment January 31st, and as you could see, it's one week prior to the deadline. So if you're from unfamiliar with the U of T writing centers, you could Google that. Uh, for this one, I have New College as well. So you could click on the website, you could book the one-on-one, -on -one, or you go to the writing room, which is a drop-in service. Finally, asking yourself, how many pages can I write a day? What is reasonable for me to expect? So here I have two pages, but asking yourself, okay, is one page good? Should I do 300 words, right? However you break it down, that is okay, so long as you could complete it. I also have provided myself with an extra time uh, or an extra day to do my work because just in case I fall sick, just in case I have too many uh, lectures in one day and I'm unable to do the two pages, I've given myself a buffer time. And finally, it's time to revise and submit nicely before the submission date. So hopefully this is really helpful for you and good luck in assignment planning.